Hi, my name is Cody Light with Atco Fuse. Today I'm standing in front of a FENT 900 Gen 6, and we're going to discuss how to set up Network RTK in your Vario terminal. To set up your Network RTK connection, you're going to want to, from your home screen, double tap the guidance button. Now we want to go into our system setting, and then we want to choose our correction signal menu. From here, we're going to want to choose your RTK network from the signal type. So simply click the drop down and choose RTK network and check it. Now the modem type, there's two selections here, internal or external modem. If you're utilizing the modem within the VDO3 or VDO4, you're going to want to use your internal modem. If you're using an external modem like an Intuacom or possibly a Digifarm uh, beacon, you're going to want to choose external. For this exercise, we're going to utilize the modem within the VDO3, so we want to choose internal modem. Within that, the last piece on this is the signal format. This will come from your NTRIP provider. Most of the time, you're going to utilize RTCM 3.1, but again, that will come from your NTRIP provider, so make sure that is set up correctly. We're going to go in and make sure our cell connection is set up first. So we'll go to our connection settings, and you want to make sure your network operator is selected. If this is a fresh start and you don't have the same connection as the default ones, you simply want to hit the add button, create it, and then select that one. Here, we're gonna go with the test network operator, and you can see that we have three bars of signal strength. We're connected to 3G and to our AT&T network. The button in the upper right is your roaming button. You will want to make sure through your cell data plan that roaming is enabled. If it is, you can enable that button and in the areas where needed, the cell modem will roam onto another network. Once that is set up, we need to set up our NTRIP settings. Within the NTRIP settings, you have items like IP address, mount point, your port, and the username and password. All of that information will come from your NTRIP provider. In this case, again, we're using the Digifarm VBN network all of those settings came from our Digifarm VBN subscription. Once you have all of that set up, you want to back out, and now we want to enable the system. So you will hit the phone button to pick up, and you will see on the screen that NTRIP will connect. We are receiving correction data. Connection status will be a green check mark, change to good, and you will see that we're down to our half inch accuracy in a matter of five seconds. That is how you set up RTK Network. Thanks for watching.